Okay, this is an update of my uh, second indoor mini aquaponics system. Um, been having real good luck with uh, keeping the water quality where I want it. And for the most part, I'm really happy with the way this system is performing. Um, I do have a little problem here. Uh, these lettuce plants aren't doing so pretty good. But uh, this is where I added the pH down, and I think that's what messed these plants up. I'll uh, probably end up replacing those. You remember the onion plant I planted last week? Um, it's grown this much in a week. This one, this much in a week. This one, this much in a week. And this one, this much in a week. My uh, tomato plant's coming right along. Uh, the lettuce plants that I have farther away from where I added the pH down are doing okay. I put a uh, basil cutting in here from uh, one of my other systems. Um, this lettuce plant is doing wonderful. These cabbage plants are doing okay. My uh, fish are doing okay. Haven't lost any more fish since I went through the initial ammonia and uh, nitrite spike. Um, probably time to add some more um, goldfish. And uh, Miss Zoe wants to get in on the act again. Come on, girl. Let's go. Um, but everything's going really well. Um, if you guys have any questions, uh, please feel free to ask. And uh, I'm really happy with uh, using hydrogen here. The uh, I guess there's a reason why the uh, hydroponic guys use this stuff. It is uh, really pH neutral. Uh, the rocks I have in my other systems, I have to put pH down in them all the time to keep them where I want them. Um, this one, I don't. And uh, looks like I'm going to have to start buffering it up, which I haven't had to do on any of my other systems yet. But uh, if you like this sort of sort of thing, please subscribe, and uh, if you would, please hit the like button. Um, again, if you have any questions, don't don't be bashful. If I know the answer, I'll answer it. If I don't, I'll point you in the right direction. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.